High performance is something that I look at as being simple, but not necessarily easy. The complicated ideas are not the ones that will usually help. And we think that luck has a lot to do with it. But luck has nothing to do with your high performance. You need a practiced, polished, pleasant, professional presentation to prepare premier prospects to purchase proper product promptly. Number one need clients have of advisors today is leadership for you to lead them in some direction to just provide a higher and a better level of service than ever before. If you know what you're fishing for, you know where to go fishing, you know what they look like when you get one. If I find out that you don't have enough money saved for your RRSP, and your, if your retirement is going to hell in a handcart and you're gonna be broke, you'll be living in a cardboard box under a Dufferin Street bridge, if that's what I've discovered and I leave that with you, have I made you better off than I found you? No, I have made it worse, not better, you're exactly right. You had a problem before, but you were blissfully unaware of it. Now, you are acutely aware of it. Isn't that amazing? How could that be? Purpose starts everything. But it's not about that. It's like I said yesterday, the magic is knowing the effort required. Rule number one, what's right is right. I think you know what the right thing to do is. You're gonna find out that as a thinker, you can do things that maybe you never dreamed of doing before. But you can't do it because everybody else thinks it's a good idea. It's where we play the world's most deadly game and the name of the game is follow the follower. And you know something, folks, that has never been the way to do anything. Wealth is a consciousness. After you break that first mile or something, then one day, all of a sudden, when you run into that wall in your mind, you say, no, no, I can do this. And you break through one of those barriers. If you knew or recognized what you're avoiding and you act on it, you make that slight change, everything will get better. Really think and just, just let go of a lot of this stuff that maybe you're hanging on to. See if you can do it for just a moment and say, what do I need to do to break through this challenge? Where there is no vision, the people will perish. How many times have we heard that? How did you do all of this in such a short period of time? He said, it was the day I stopped lying to myself because as long as you're allowing excuses conditions and circumstances to control your choices nothing's going to change by the repetition by the consistency of my action and activity that's going to create the habits that i need to do what i need to do we believe the overriding force that motivates people is due to their choice of environment to be in business market how would I grow into that well you would grow into that it's outside of the comfort zone that we're in today if you set a goal you are making a demand on the universe and that's what you can do today not next week not next month but now how much you change is relatively unimportant compared to the fact that you do change obstacles become opportunities average becomes awesome you go from mediocre to magnificent be proactive not reactive you don't have to wait to have that kind of feeling we can start to improve that beginning today you can do it today or you can do it never that is a stimulus what is your response